Hello, and welcome to episode four of Making Shit Up. Uh, this episode, I'm going to be uh, modifying an existing riff that was done by a band mm, late 60s, early 70s. Uh, it's a very well-known riff, and uh, part of the reason I'm doing this is to show you what you can do with something that somebody else has already done. And a lot of the music today, um, if you really listen to it, a lot of the riffs are riffs that somebody else has already came up with. And subsequently, they've changed the speed, they've changed the tone, and they changed the melody a little bit, but it's still the same riff. So, in part, I'm just going to show you how simple it can be when you're stuck and you need just a little something to uh, get you going. So anyway, let's, let's just get to it. Let's start off with uh, clean tone. And it may not be exact, but uh, I'll give you the, the basic riff. sound exactly like the original uh, band did in the late 60s, early 70s, but you know what it is. I'll do it one more time. So, that's the basic riff, and uh, I'm sure you know what it is. But anyway, um, I've played around with it, and I get stuck every now and then, and while I'm practicing, it just kind of helps me unwind. So, let's kick over some distortion. There we go. And... Uh, I'll play around with it and I'll show you what I came up with. So there's one little version that I came up with just to kind of tweak it out a little bit. enough so I kept going give a little something extra there <laughs> Sometimes it's just that simple. Uh, you want to go a little more with it. Play around with the bar chords at the end. Get it however you want. Uh, for my purposes, uh, I just play around with it. Give it a little low end crunch. 
punch at the end. Um, so basically, like I said, a lot of the riffs that you're going to hear, um, somebody else has already done it. Um, essentially what they're doing is they're altering, they, they may not even realize they're doing it, something that they've heard so many times and subconsciously they don't even recognize it when they're doing it, but uh, a lot of the riffs are used by somebody else and they subsequently alter them, they change the tone and do whatever they want to with it essentially. But uh, so there you go. Uh, hit it a couple more times for you, just just because. <laughs> That's uh, the end of episode uh, four, but I just wanted to get that in there. Also wanted to uh, get a video with the SG before it goes bye-bye. Uh, but yeah, so play around, have fun. <laughs> As always, peace, rock on, have a good one. Alright, see you on the next episode.